going everyone so I've been uh, experimenting a little bit more with uh, soaking grass with the liquid fermentation blend I produce using some beneficial microbes and some frass so I chuck the medium onto this grass here and it rained heavily uh, yesterday incredibly amount of rain I mean incredible but here's the results I'm having from using these slurries and then chucking them on the grass you see a lot of development going on a lot of breaking down going on it's, it's warm it smells great it's working very well and I use this as a compost uh, or you sometimes I use it as a mulch as well and I just build up my soil with this and I just keep adding microbes and frass and I don't ever turn it I just let it do its thing decompose I mean you'll see this looks great it smells great very active very alive I love using grass it's very abundant and then you just chuck your microbes on them and then let it sit you'll see I just push this back I have a rake over here and that's it that's all you really do it's really not too difficult and if you really want to get intense uh, you just add some biochar and then that also assists with everything See, I'm peeling it back. It's all white. It's all breaking down. It's all becoming releasing its all compounds, making humic substances, everything. It's going to help grow soil. How quick can you degrade your organic matter in a controlled environment? Because you don't want this going out of control. If it goes out of control, then it's like literally a war zone. So I don't want a war zone. I want like my microbes to be happy and everyone to be living happily together symbiotically. So that's what microbes do. So I'm going to go feed some microbes. Um, I had some viewers commented that they think the gassing is occurring from trapped sediments down below. So I'll show you guys in that video. It's coming up next. We'll see if that's the case. We're going to stir that and then feed it. We'll see. <laughs> 